Hi there, I'm Tom Monroe, the Home Inspector. I'm on an inspection today of an actual brand new home. And the person that's bought this home has asked me to do an inspection looking for things that are gonna cause problems and things that have not been installed to the BC Building Code. I've inspected the whole home and found numerous problems here, but I wanna point out one thing in particular is a retaining wall in the backyard. It's an engineered wall, has a spread footing connected to the hard pan, but the builder has neglected to put the proper drainage behind the wall. Let me show you what they should have done, and let me show you what they've done, which is a makeshift solution that's not going to work, and I'm going to show you why. Here we go. So this home has numerous engineered structural concrete retaining walls behind it. These walls are over four feet tall. They have spread footings sitting on top of the hard pan. And when you have spread footings sitting on hard pan, it creates a dam behind the wall. Now, in order to reduce the hydrostatic pressure of all the rainwater and all the surface water coming down from that mountain above, you need to have horizontal piping with proper cleanouts at the ends to make sure it can be serviced every five years. Now the builder has neglected to put that horizontal pipe behind that retaining wall. So what will happen in about 10 years is that water behind will start to permeate through and migrate through that concrete retaining wall because there's no damp proofing on that retaining wall on the back side and white effervescence will start to form and will start looking unsightly in just 10 years. A drainage contractor came here and gave him a quick make, makeshift solution to a problem and I'm going to show you exactly what he suggested they do. Drainage contractor suggested installing this collection basin. This collection basin is supposed to pick up all the surface water in this area but they've installed that, that collection basin and the collection basin doesn't have a bottom to it. Now I've been running a hose in there, connecting this to the house, and it's been working. But, as you know how a dam works, water fills up, gets to a point, and can drain out. The problem is, this pipe, this location, is quite a ways up this collection basin. And if I run the water, you'll see the water just drains out the bottom. They are not eliminating the hydrostatic pressure here at all behind the wall. What they're doing is they're waiting for the water to build up to a certain level, which is the top of the stairs, before it'll actually start to drain out. The problem is, is the whole wall cavity needs to fill with water first before this drain pipe starts to work. And having the wall fill with water actually creates hydrostatic pressure behind it, and it doesn't cure the problem at all. So this is why it is so important to hire an independent, certified home inspector to locate the deficiencies of your new home before you move into it. That way they can be fixed so they aren't causing you headaches for you and your family. If you have any home related questions you'd like me to discuss, leave them in the comments below and let's figure them out. I post videos weekly. Don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, I'm Tom Monroe, The Home Inspector.